If things happen it's because God has prepared me. God has great things for us. If it's God's will that I be there, there I will be. I learned that it is faith that decides whether something will happen or not. I have my life. I have my values. And compared with much of society, especially football, that is radical. I would love to have a career like Zinedine Zidane. He stopped playing, took some time, realized he liked coaching and started working in the youth academy. I could follow a similar path. It's important for me to keep improving. It's not my place to make judgments about the behavior of other footballers. Cars and women, things like that, never mattered to me. My family and my belief in God are the things that define my life. One always wants more when things work out. It's not easy to decide what is best for you in the future. Every opportunity that presents itself, my main objective is to conquer and be victorious. When things go well, everyone talks well of you and vice versa. Unfortunately, football is like that. I have been in many teams that have had loads of talent but did not make it through and been with teams that did not have that much talent and ended up being champions. I do want to live my life in the right way, and live my life close to God. When I do an interview, when I appear on camera, I want to be the same person as the one you meet personally and say, he is really the same person I saw on television. It was very difficult when I was with the national team and we were playing in some of the poorer areas of Brazil. You see people come and watch us practice or play, and then some of them go home without food on their plates. I use a few phrases to let people know a little bit about who I am. One is that I belong to God which is a phrase I always wear on my shirt during the most important moments of my professional career. I can still dream about my successes, 